everybody, my name is Angela. We're here at the Huron Public Library. Today we're doing our May craft and we're going to be doing bird houses. So let's get started. Okay, so if you signed up for a kit, you would have gotten a hair bag like this with your contents in it. And inside would have been your instructions, a wooden bird house, and a wooden candlestick. And then also uh, two colors of paint, white and blue. And then a small bag with your um, flowers and gemstones in there. There's two flowers, four gemstones, and one leaf. And then what you're going to need from home is you're going to need um, some school glue, not a lot. Um, two, I brought two paintbrushes, but you could do it with one. Um, but because we have two colors, I grabbed two. And then also a hot glue gun. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do for our house is we're going to we're going to paint the house in the candlestick. So you're going to want to remove the sticker on the back. And then we're going to remove this rope part. So there should be two knots inside. If you can't reach them, just push this down a little bit. Okay, and then pull on the, the knot. It should come right out if you can get a hold of it. Pull it right out. All right. And I'm not going to use this, so I'm going to discard it. Okay, so we're going to paint our candlestick white. And then for my birdhouse, I painted the roof white and the fence white and I painted the birdhouse blue. Let's grab our paint. Okay, we'll start with our candlestick and then we're just going to do a light coat on the bottom. Okay. Okay, so once you've got a good coat on there, just set it off to the side to dry. Okay. And then for our birdhouse, I'm going to continue with my white. I'll start on the roof and then we'll go move to blue after that. Okay, and you might need two coats to let it dry. Um, maybe not. It depends because this is pretty light wood and it spreads pretty nice. Okay, and we're just going to keep going. Okay, so I'm on my second coat of blue here. And as you can see, it's dry and darker. And let's get that last second coat on. Okay. Real careful not to touch the white here. Okay. Make sure you get the inside of your heart here. Okay, and we're just going to let that dry. And then after that dries, we'll glue it to our candlestick. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to glue our birdhouse to our candlestick and make sure it's not still wet. And you want to make sure that it's, it stays on top. So it should sit on top of your candlestick before you glue it. If you glue it too far back, it might fall over. So about right there. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to put hot glue on the rim. Just take your glue gun and just stick it right on top like that. And then just stick your birdhouse right on top of that. And then hold it there for a little bit. All right. Okay, so what we're gonna do next is we're gonna take our flowers and our gemstones. We'll just set them out so we can see what we got. So we've got our two flowers and our gems. The big gems are gonna go in the center of the flowers and you can pick what color. I'm gonna do the light, um, lighter one. You might have different colors, you might not have purple. Um, and they have adhesive on them so you can just stick them right in the middle. I'll we'll take the other one and stick them in the middle of our purple flower. There we go. And we're going to just glue them on top and they're going to cover up that hole that we created when we took out the rope. I'm just going to put the glue right on the birdhouse because it's white and it'll dry clear and our paint's white. So just spread it on. Use my finger to rub it around and then we'll take our flower and put it right there. And I'm going to bend it over top of the roof line so that it covers up that hole. Okay. Hold it down with the glue, and then we'll add glue to this side as well, so that it stays on this side too. Okay. Move our glue around. Pull the flower down. And then I'm going to do our leaf next. And it might stick off your birdhouse a little bit, that's fine. Okay, and then the purple one will add some more glue. I'm going to put it right here. I'll just lay it right on top. Okay, 
and this glue will dry clear, so that's nice. Okay, so the last thing we're going to do is I have these two little gemstones, and I'm going to set, put them right above and below the, the heart here. You could put them somewhere else, but that's where I'm going to put mine. And they have a little bit of adhesive on the back. If for some reason that adhesive leaves, you can use the, the school glue. Put that one right there. There we go. And, oh, got glue and paint all over my fingers. There we go. One right at the bottom. There you go. Thank you for joining us today for our May craft for our birdhouses. My name is Angela here at the Huron Public Library. And if you'd like to sign up for our June craft, registration is now open. You can call us or visit our website at library.huronsd.com. And we'd love to see some pictures of your birdhouses. So please send them to us on Facebook Messenger or call the library. Have a good day.